Hundreds of animals at the local Humane Society were threatened with potential evacuation orders as a nearby fire spread fast this afternoon. Four area fire departments together extinguished the flames before it got that far. We begin tonight with our own Shadiah Tomlin, who was at the scene as smoke filled the, filled the air and ash covered our news vehicle. Shadiah, what are you seeing at this hour tonight? Lauren, it took about six or seven fire trucks to get this fire under control, and it started right here in this yard. As you can see, it looks dark, but it's actually the ground is charred back there, and that you can see back there that some of those flames are still going. And I was able to speak with some of the people in the area about how the fire looked when it all went down. Whenever they saw the smoke, they started getting a little worried, but weren't sure maybe it was leaves or something. And then it just quickly started building up more and more. Witnesses report something as small as a cigarette caused a fire north of Springfield that took hours to contain Sunday afternoon. Homeowner Randy Mettler said he was doing yard work when he saw a man throw a cigarette over the fence into his yard, causing his property to catch fire. Down along the fences over here, and apparently he threw a cigarette out because we were out mowing and we saw it. Just moments later, the flames were about five feet high and making their way across this field. By the time we got over there, it had already gotten out of hand. It's been about three hours. The Humane Society of Southwest Missouri could see the flames from its lobby. Katie Newcomb was worried that if the flames spread any further, they would have to evacuate hundreds of animals from the building. So we have about 300 or more animals. We were able to get everyone in the lobby and trying to stay there for a second until we eventually knew it was clear. And then we locked our doors, closed down for the day, and made sure just very minimal staff that was needed was here. Multiple fire departments helped contain the fire, and it took about three hours to get everything under control. Willard and Ebenezer are over here and Battlefield, and then Springfield still over by the Humane Society. Luckily, um, the department did very well and was able to contain it enough that it was able to kind of steer away from us. I'm glad it's over. Now, luckily, no animals or the property owner's home was not hurt in any way. Um, they are deciding to call some of the fire um, officials back to check on these um, flames that are going on still in the background. But Right now, nobody is hurt. Reporting in Greene County, I'm Shadiah Tomlin, Ozarks First.